Okay, how to buy the perfect swimsuit. Ugh, what a nightmare. The first thing you have to remember is that the ones that you see in the magazines and in print, these extraordinary people have been chosen and spend their entire lives just modeling what you're looking at. So don't set the bar too high for yourself and don't torture yourself. A couple of things to remember though first, are you going to just be laying on the beach looking glorious? Are you going to be splashing around in the waves? Or are you really going to be swimming in this suit? Are you, do you have an active lifestyle? Because the reality is, a bit like the bras in your closet, it may be a number of different suits for different reasons. One of them just for tanning and laying down and looking gorgeous. Another one where you're actually moving around. Do you want a Brazilian cut because you want your cheeks to show because you're going to some far exotic place? Or are you a little more self-conscious? Like any other dressing, it's about accentuating the positive and just kind of disguising or gently not drawing attention to the pieces of yourself you're not as comfortable with. So it doesn't have to be super skin skimpy. Make sure that um, the bust fits you. And remember, there are a lot of stores out there where you can buy the two pieces separately. A lot of us are not, I certainly am not, the same on the top as the bottom. So it's okay to go in and say, this is the top half of me and this is the bottom half of me. And if you have to do a suit um, and you want to do a one piece, then what you may have to do is play with the cup size um, or the bottom and have it altered slightly. A lot of people think, oh, well, I just buy it and if it fits, it fits, and if it doesn't fit, quite right, that's okay. Remember that spandex can get altered as well. Um, and so you can have a suit altered if you need to. Also remember they do wear out. Uh, the chlorine and the salt water do erode the fabric. So what looked fabulous on you last year may not look good on you this year. You want to make sure that it looks good through the back and it cuts you in the right place. That's honestly almost as important as how it fits you fits you through the front. So make sure that when you go out to buy it, you're looking in a three-way mirror. And if you're not crazy about your legs, I for one am not crazy about my legs, then take advantage of going to the sarong section, find a suit that you love, and you can wear it with a sarong. That's what the beach is for. So think of it a little bit outside of the box. Don't go about ordering it or trying it on the same way you did when you were in the wading pool at six or eight years old. And don't be too hard on yourself.